The Gisborne Herald Home and Lifestyle Expo attracted crowds over the weekend. The expo, which was run by the Gisborne Herald, was first held in 2011. Featured exhibitors showing health and beauty products, electronics, home improvement and lifestyle products. Although COVID resulted in a cancellation of the event last year, event organiser Andy Searle said thousands of people flocked in the Farmer's Ear Event Centre over two days. It was very good. Saturday was busier than Sunday and the numbers over the weekend match anything we had ever seen. It's fantastic. So many people coming through. Lot, lots of interest. Uh, everyone's friendly and nice and, and they all say hello to you which is so, so nice. So some of the shows I go to, people are a little bit quiet and don't talk much but Gisborne's a great place to be I think. We're Hexton Bee Company and we have a um, beekeeping company that produces a range of bee products from candles to honey to balms to beeswax wraps and our product's all about health and well-being and sustainability. I have found the organisers really friendly, really helpful. Um, I only booked quite late so I was lucky to get in. So far there's been good numbers of people through so I'm happy. Our stool is a healing light, heals, heals at a cellular level, so it can help people with most of their health problems. Hmm. So we're here to help people. This is um, ATS's stall at the, um, at the 2021 Home Show. Um, so we have three divisions at ATS. Uh, we've got our tree division. Um, I'm a qualified arborist. We also have a civil landscaping um, and earthworks uh, division. And we also have our two qualified linesmen who work for us. We've been here a few times. There's always a good number of people come through. Uh, people are, are generally wanting to talk so we get to have a good chat uh, we like to be at the end of the show here so everyone's kind of seen what they need to see and uh, got the time to spend with us always near the cafe is a good place to, to hang out